أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم When the hypocrites come to you, they say, We bear witness that you are indeed the messenger of Allah. Yea, Allah knows that you are indeed his messenger. And Allah bears witness that the hypocrites are indeed liars. They have made their oaths a screen for their misdeeds. Thus they obstruct men from the path of Allah, truly evil of their deeds. That is, because they believed. Then they rejected faith. So a seal was set on their hearts, therefore they understand not. When you look at them, their exteriors please you, and when they speak, you listen to their words. They are as worthless as hollow pieces of timber propped up, unable to stand on their own. They think that every cry is against them. They are the enemies. So beware of them, the curse of Allah be on them. How are they deluded away from the truth? And when it is said to them, Come, the Messenger of Allah will pray for your forgiveness, they turn aside their heads, and you would see them turning away their faces in arrogance. It is equal to them whether you pray for their forgiveness or not. Allah will not forgive them. Truly, Allah guides not rebellious transgressors. They are the ones who say, Spend nothing on those who are with Allah's Messenger, to the end that they may disperse and quit Medina. But to Allah belong the treasures of the heavens and the earth, but the hypocrites understand not. They say, If we return to Medina, surely the more honorable element will expel therefrom the Mina, but honor belongs to Allah and His Messenger, and to the believers, but the hypocrites know not. O you who believe, let not your riches or your children divert you from the remembrance of Allah. If any act thus, the loss is their own. And spend something in charity out of the substance which we have bestowed on you, before death should come to any of you, and he should say, O my Lord, why did you not give me respite for a little while? I should then have given largely in charity, and I should have been one of the doers of good. But to no soul will Allah grant respite when the time appointed for it has come, and Allah is well acquainted with all that you do.